Hey guys, welcome to this video where we're going to be talking about Quen 3 Coda Plus. I wouldn't normally talk about a model like this, however, I've been recently pretty impressed with Quen 3 and just how well it's actually working and how well it works, etc, etc. So I'm going to be testing out in this video. I've already got the benchmark, the normal bog standard benchmark running um, here, uh, which is the benchmark that I always do. It's this one here. It's the prompt to generate a service website. But at the same time, what I want to test is I want to test the same prompt inside um, the CLI, right? Because you can see here, this is Quen3 Coder Plus, which is the new model. So let's just do the same thing. So MKD Coder Plus, CD Coder Plus, then we'll write Quen, and then we'll put the same prompt here. There we go. So now it's doing both things at the same time. It's running two, right? So we have one where it's created the next, the next my app using Kilo code. And then we're going to do the other one now. Now I need to put this on um, where it doesn't ask constantly for permission to do things. So let's just see how to do that. Auto approve, auto approve enabled, just everything. Um, right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I just want everything. Can I just put a star here maybe? And save, done. And so save. Okay, there we go, done. So that should put everything on auto approved. So far, this is pretty quick, I have to say. Surprisingly quick. Um, let's see if I can do the same thing here where I skip permissions, accepting edits. Okay, so they've copied Claude code. So. Okay, so we've got both running here, I hope. Okay, this one is struggling, obviously, but let's see if it can work through the, the struggle. Yeah, looks like that did it. Looks like it installed it properly. This is flying, I have to say. This is absolutely flying so far. Yes, always allow, come on. So yeah, Quencoder, I've been really impressed with uh, Quencode Max was the model that I used. Very, very impressive stuff. But it wasn't available in Quen Coder. So now that we can use the latest model inside Quen Coder, I'm very, very curious to see just how effective this new Quen system actually is. So I'll let these run, guys, and I'll give you my thoughts on them in just a second. A couple of things to note. This is a brand new model five days ago, 17th of September. Quen 3 Coder Plus. It's Alibaba's proprietary version of the open source Quen 3 Coder 480A350B. Uh, or 35B. It is a powerful coding agent uh, model specializing in autonomous programming via tool calling, environment uh, interaction, combining coding proficiency with versatile general purpose abilities. So what that basically means is it should actually perform even better inside Claude CLI. And I can tell you, uh, sorry, not Claude CLI, uh, Quen CLI. And I can tell you right now, that is a very good um, data page. Like normally they're much shorter. So I can already tell that this is actually an extremely good model um and it's just so fast as well it's actually kind of crazy i'll let these run guys we'll go through them once it's done we'll see how many mistakes how many errors there are etc etc okay so the cli one is completed uh kilo code one is still running uh my old school runescape iron man is still splashing so everything is fine there uh let's just see if this is any good basically so uh, this is in Coda Plus. So I need to go to Coda Plus. There we go. And then I need to open that inside Visual Studio Code. So we've got a new window here. File, open folder. Coda Plus. Okay. And then we go Terminal, New Terminal. We do CD My Next App, NPM Run Dev, which should work. First time, there we go. And let's see, okay. Some color problems, pretty basic layout, but I mean, it's done the job for sure. Looks like everything is generated properly. Yeah, okay, not bad. Not a bad attempt at all, to be honest with you. For quite a cheap model, this is pretty good. Um, I would say this would be good as like the coding model and then using something else as like the planning model. Let's see. Yeah, I mean, the code here is pretty perfect, to be frank. Oh, there we go. Pagina non trovata, which is page not found. So there are some um, 404 issues on here, which is a bad sign. But yeah, I mean, overall, this is a pretty damn good attempt by um, 
by Quen again, right? Comparing this to, oh, this says 2023, that's interesting. Compared, comparing this to most of the, um, I know this isn't free or open source, but like based off a free or open source model, like we haven't heard anything from Llama, for example, in fucking ages, by the way, can I just say? <laughs> never heard any never heard anything back from llama and meta and stuff but quen have been cooking and yeah this is pretty damn cool so this is using my quen subscription just so you know guys um i'm not actually sure oh quen max preview so there's another one here interesting the most powerful language model in the quen series i'll have to be testing that out as well in a moment i think i did test that before but it's not available in the quen cli so that's what kind of what i was waiting for I just wanted to see if I'm paying for this because I'm I'm really not sure if I'm paying for this or not. Um, okay, so Quen Three Max Preview, which I didn't see on Open Router as far as I know. Let's have a look. No, it's not. So Quen Three Max is here, but Quen Three Max Preview isn't. Yeah, this is the one I tested before on September the fifth. I remember. I wonder if they're the same model. Quen's next model is going to be very, very interesting, guys, I have to say. I don't think I'm paying for this. I'm, pr I'm pretty sure I'm not paying for this. So this is a free, almost as good as fucking um, Claude model, which is completely crazy when you think about it. Okay, let's see how Kilo Code is getting on. Uh, looks like it's still got a bit of work to go. I'd be curious to see if there's any uh, like a big difference. This costs 175 on API costs, which is pretty reasonable. I'm just curious if there's going to be a big difference between these two or not. Okay, so I haven't really got time to wait for this to fully finish, but this is what um, Kilo Code built. It does have a few errors, but uh, obviously it, it's not really a fair comparison because I'm not I'm not letting it fully run. But I mean, I would say this looks a little bit different um to the other one which is good it looks a little bit better but it is still pretty basic just like the other one uh it's automatically in italian which uh like i said i haven't fully hang on there we go okay so the english one didn't even work there oh that's because of that okay let's see if i put weddings here yeah it works um so yeah overall this is pretty good for a medium level not free but based off a free and open source model like traditionally they've been absolutely crap this is alibaba's um proprietary version of quen quen is open source and free they took quen and they built this and it's a very low cost model that can do pretty good code to be honest with you so if that's what you're looking for this is definitely worth your time i think in my opinion the next quen model um, Quen Max. Once Quen Max is available inside Quen CLI, I genuinely believe it's going to be a competitor for uh, Claude Code. Um, but yeah, you may call me crazy, but that's my opinion. Thanks so much for watching, guys. If you're watching all the way to the end of the video, you're an absolute legend, and I'll see you very soon with some more content. Peace out.